Hello, welcome back to my boys Koi. A uh, Koi dealer here in Klangoflin, Langollen to the rest of the world, they don't speak Welsh. And uh, look at that beautiful Welsh countryside. So, as uh, you can also see, there's no polytunnel cover, so that ripped off. Um, yeah, that ripped off, a little bit of a disaster, no big deal, new one coming. They, they are great, these polytunnels are really cheap, they're good, but they're sewn together. And you see where the stitching is. That stitching comes apart, wing gets inside it, they're gonna tear. So, uh, I have ordered another one for now, but not a long term plan, they're gonna get sorted out. See all my bowls behind me, everything got bleached down today, and had a good wash. Because I'm just on a bit of a cleaning spree, I thought why not, might as well keep everything tidy. As you see, there's no fish in here now, everything had to get moved into that tunnel, because obviously we were keeping a lot higher temperature in this tunnel, so um, everything's had to have a bit of a shift around in here. So yeah, <coughs> to make everything fit. So new tunnel going on uh, tomorrow, I think it arrives, or maybe Thursday, so by the weekend new tunnel going on. More fish arriving all the time now, fish arriving, fish going out. Absolutely fantastic. We've got two, four, five ponds in here. Uh, normally two ponds in here, pond down the bottom. That one's going to be up and running in the shed uh, come the weekend as well. So that'll be uh, five, six, seven, eight, nine. And I, I want the wooden sleeper one done very shortly too. So it'll be ten, ten ponds. Um, but no, fish are looking great. See, you can see some behind me there. Everything's covered over, everything is, everything's netted. Now, this green net that you use for scaffolding is absolutely fantastic, really strong, strong durable stuff. My heated grow one that was in there, it had 80 fish in it. So what I've had to do, because I've, I've been limited on pond space, I've had to put the bigger ones, 30 big ones in there, the 50 small ones in here. Uh, the big ones wouldn't have done well in here, the small ones are still quite small. She did really need separate separating out anyway, so um, that was no big deal to be honest. I had already started set, separating them out the day before, put them in the floating basket, drop a little clip in now you'll see it. Putting them in the floating basket, sorting through it, um, and then the poison will probably ripped off that night, so it was what it was, no big deal. My boys Koi, what's happening? What has been happening? To be honest, it, it's fantastic. Um, I'm not going to sit here telling I'm, I'm making millions because that's not true, but I was just holding the food. Um, yeah, I'm not saying I'm going to be making millions because that's not true, but sales are unbelievable. Um, the more, look at that sunset through the tunnel. Yeah, sales are unbelievable. I'm literally selling fish every single day of the week now. Uh, auctions are doing great. I've sold the biggest fish that I've ever sold, 64 cm. I sold that uh, two days ago, I think it was. Um, I've got big fish coming in now. I've just bought two 60 centimeter chags. Um, I've, th there's just loads of big fish out, and then a 56 cm uh, tan show. Um, oh, there's loads. Th th there's just loads of fish. I'm just I'm absolutely inundated with fish. I'll drop this one in as well. This is the one that I sold a couple of months ago, well, about a month or so ago now to a customer. Um, I've just been holding on to it while his pond's getting finished. His pond's nearly ready, so did this one as well. Absolutely unbelievable. Um, it's safe like fish getting delivered all the time now. Buying fish all the time, which is the best part for me. The more fish to sell, the more fish I get to buy. Um, some make it to the growing, which is just for my own like amusement, really. I, I took a... A she, uh, Omosako Shiro Tori, I got it at 22 cm. It's now 35. I've owned it for like six weeks. It's, it's just crazy. So that's, that's in there as well. That's why obviously they couldn't be in with them small ones. But yeah, I just wanted to give a bit of an update. Um, I'm just loving life. Honest to God, I'm loving life. And I just love being doing what I'm doing at the minute. It's a work in progress. I haven't got a massive, massive shop yet. Um, but I haven't got a massive, massive shop. I've got my back garden. I've got me eight to ten ponds. Um, got amazing customers constantly on me. I yeah, it's just just good. Um, SKS accounts just opened. I'm going to start doing dry goods very shortly. If I'm totally honest, I can't be bothered. I don't really need to. A lot of stress for a little bit of money. So I will do that when um, when I'm ready to do it. But yeah, it's uh, it's a lot of work for not a lot of markup on them. So, so to be honest, you know what I mean. I enjoy the fish. I enjoy doing the fish. I, I enjoy buying the fish, selling the fish. 
I don't necessarily enjoy buying and selling nets, do you know what I mean? So I will do that as and when, not in a major rush, unless forced to get in that situation, then maybe I will, but right now I'm not in a big rush. But yeah, so everything else is good. Love that sunset. Out here is still a bit of a mess. Obviously when that's all come down, everything just got dragged out onto the grass. Um, but yeah, but after that, it's all good. Um, gonna get these two set back up now so that easy pod is a new easy pod that easy pod is a new easy pod that easy pod's a new easy pod um show you up on the driveway um there's a drum filter a nexus 220 and a nexus 310 all up there waiting to be put into use um yeah it's just non-stop to be honest the more fish you sell i'll be honest and people might not believe this but the more fish you sell the more fish you buy the more equipment to buy that's all i do with it so i just constantly buying equipment and buying fish and it's just fantastic and it's meaning that i can give fish at good prices as well someone said to me the other week they were like how are you doing it i said well it's as simple you know, I buy a lot of fish, I sell them at good prices, I use that money to buy more fish, I sell them at good prices. It's quite easy, do you know what I mean? Um, that pond actually is absolutely fantastic. Get a good flow going around that circle motion, works really, really well, you know. Only running off an easy pod, had 80 fish in there, running trace ammonia, and when I mean trace, I mean it was near enough yellow, it was so light. And 80 fish were just living fantastically well and growing like stink in that pond so that pond is i'm just waiting to get it reset back up the only problem is the easy pod that was on there is now in there uh, because obviously them fish kept their easy pod so that was just a frantic hour to move them around and stuff like that and pump the water over so they had the same water but anyway got there in the end no big deal and that's pretty much it so uh yeah just for to give a little bit of an update, bit of a boring video, not a lot happening, selling a lot of fish, got a lot of fish for sale. If anyone wants to buy fish, drop me a message, send me a message to myboysquoygmail.com. Uh, hit the like, hit the subscribe button, loads more coming. And there's going to be a shop, My Boys Koi is going to be saying as a shop soon. Might not be the biggest in the UK, but it's all my business, it's just going to grow. And every penny I make, I'm just going to put back in to make a bigger and better company for everyone else who's, uh, who supports me. There's uh, no management team, there's no one telling me what to do. It just means I can buy fish, I can sell them at good prices. You get good fish at good prices. All of my customers seem very, very happy. They keep coming back for more. What more can you ask for? So anyway, I'm just going on with myself. I appreciate everyone watching. Love that guy. Uh, appreciate everyone watching. I will catch you all next time with a polytunnel complete.